again everyone how are you all hope you're all well friday so it's spectrum day again and today's classic we're going to be playing chucky egg i'm sure many 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 hours have been lost playing this and not just on the spectrum this came out on the commodore 64 the amstrad the bbc micro the um, dragon 32 even on the amiga don't play it on the amiga it's bad <laughs> it just is. Just because something's got enhanced graphics doesn't mean it's a better game. Um, so yeah, Chucky Egg, absolute classic sort of arcade platformer game. Uh, there is also Chucky Egg 2. Um, I don't think we're going to look at that in this video. Maybe it'll be for another day. They are very different games. Um, we're talking about the other computers that had it, right? I can't let this slide. It was on the Commodore 64, right? And this is the Commodore 64 case artwork for Chucky Egg. Yeah, looks fairly similar. You could agree. You can definitely tell one is for a different system. And here we have Chucky Egg 2. And obviously eggs are, eggs are hatching for the birds to come back for a sequel. Yeah, whatever the whole idea was. And if you're a Commodore fan or even know bad artwork, you know what is coming. What is this? I mean, what the hell is this? It's this thing of nightmares. Chucky Egg 2 for the Commodore 64. We are most definitely going to be playing this in the future. I haven't had my Commodore fit, um, set up for a long time. But, wow. Are you ready? Are you ready? Can this be the thumbnail? <sighs> Defend that, all you Commodore fanboys. Defend that. <laughs> anyway, that's not what we're talking about today, so that can go over there. Uh, we'll get rid of all the others. And, yeah, this is it. This is what we are going to be playing today. Um, I'm not sure if there was any different um, variants of this. Oh, look at that. Look at the screenshots. Um, but, yeah, it's Chucky Egg. It really is one of those games... You can pick up and play. I will need to show it off actually on the um, on the BBC Micro. Actually, this is what I was supposed to be showing there. This bit down here. It's a forty-eight K game, arcade style game, and you are. Um, oh, what's his name again? Let me know in the comments below. What what what's the main guy's name? Uh, it's just just gone out of my head as I was, I was doing this video. So yeah, that's. Up to four players compete against each other for the high score, and I just love games that go for high score. So, yeah, it's just simple, fun, but plays very well. So, anyway, let's get on with it and let's play some Chucky Egg. Here we are, Chucky Egg. This is the main load screen. Um, you can change your one to four players. You've got your high score table down the side there. They really are wanting you to go for high scores on this. Uh, I'm sitting slightly off to the side, so I'm going to redefine my keys so I can actually. Um, play this game because use the keyboard right and jump that should do that means I'm just out the way of the actual keyboard itself right so let's start the get oh hang on I just realized there we are I've not got any sound plugged in not that there's much sound anyway but we've got to hear those classic spectrum beeps there we are that's you should be able to hear that in a second right s to start and one player and here we are. If you've never seen Chucky Egg before, hang on. There we are. Remember that sound? There it is. Right, the whole idea of this game is to, if you've never played it before, is to collect all the eggs, avoid these birds, who is trying to pin me in at the moment. Oh, there he goes. Um, you get bonus points for collecting the seed, but the seed can also... Oop, these fell off. The seed can also be used to um, stop the birds from chasing you. They stop and eat it. So what computer did you play Chucky Egg on? Because uh, I must admit, Spectrum is good. But the BBC Micro, uh, I think, is so fluid. There we go. Beep. <laughs> that psychedelic scream. Uh, later levels as well, um, this bird in this cage here will come and chase you around. I mean, there, I know there's some like there's some proper hardcore oh, missed that one. players of this game. 
who will be shouted at the screen of how bad I'm actually doing. But hey, it's all fun, isn't it? But you can see why a game like this was popular. It's just simple. Um, and just fluid, you know what I mean? There's no more as you can say about it. It just, it works. Everything on it works. You know, have you ever played like a, um, a bad port of Pac-Man? For example, and you know that the controls are just not quite right, you know, when you go around the corners and everything else. Oh, I missed that one. When you're going around the corners and sometimes you have to, like, nudge it two or three times to get it to go. Oh, that was close. Oh, ah, uh, poo. I forgot to press jump. And how many times have you heard that? Um, but yeah, as I was saying, is the controls are just work, apart from when I die. <laughs> That's more of me not working, not the game. Why am I doing so bad on this level? Here we go. Uh, you do have to be careful with your jumps, though. Um, oh, no. Because once you start jumping, that's just the art you're going in. You can't change that. Why are we over here? I was supposed to be going over here. There we are. Because I want to be over this side. That's where I was supposed to be going when I... You do bounce off stuff as well. Forgot about that. Oh, come back this way. Do, 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 do. I love his hat, though. The one thing that is consistent on all of the games is the size of his hat. Bloody massive. There we are. Yeah, I, can, I know. Oh, damn it. I forgot to press jump again. Here's me saying how good the controls are. A little secret though, I don't like this level. I really don't like, well, it's not really a secret. You can see how much I don't bloody like this level. It's this one here. I always struggle to get that one. But then again, at the moment, you think I'm struggling to get any of them. There we are. Does anyone else remember a game called Frack that was on... Oh, what was it on there? How am, I supposed to see? How am I supposed to get there? See, I'm thinking about it now. It's like, it has to be this way. No, it's that way. Oh, God, of course it bloody is. <laughs> uh, yeah, Frack. Um, I will have to show that one off. Because it's, I just, I don't, everyone always raves about how good that game is. No, I fell down. Oh, God, I could be all the way back here. Yay! Made it. I can relax now. I've got past that level. Um, but yeah, Frack. What, what an interesting game that was. It's um, You're this little caveman. And you had to kill these... Because I was playing it on the BBC Micro. And these pink monsters. Fluffy monsters. With a yo-yo. It looks like a yo-yo. Oh, what was that? <laughs> Is that me dead? Oh, no, I've got another one. Um, whilst balloons are coming up from the bottom and needles are coming down diagonal across the sky. Sounds a fun game, doesn't it? Very interesting game. Yeah, you got yeah. I definitely should have practised before doing this video. But, you know, where's the fun in that? Let's just get this egg, and then... Let's not get that egg. Oh, he almost got me again there. Let's just go this way. Gotcha. Oh, I see what it is. I, forget, I keep forgetting that you have to jump. Oh, that was close. Let's get this one down here. 
So yeah, don't don't um don't ever go at me for being a bad player. I I know already. What was your high score? That's it. Oh no! Ah, making me angry. Gotcha. Now we're just gonna go back for that one. That was me being stupid again. Nothing new there. Okay, come on, we can give it. What was that? Oh, the bouncing's annoying me now. Do you remember these frustrations playing it? <sighs> the memories are definitely coming flooding back for me. Right, well, we're on level five. Oh, no. What an idiot. Oh, we've got another one. Where are my lives, anyway? Um, can't see my lives. Oh, I forgot it's got a timer. <laughs> Have I not died from the timer? <laughs> Gonna die now, though, aren't I? Gives me some more. Do you get extra lives every time you change level? That's cool. Go on, I'm gonna run now. Go on, move out the way. Go on, get out the way. Yeah, out the way. There we are. No. Nope, should have done that. You idiot! <laughs> So that's Chucky Egg. I'm sure everyone else can do a hell of a lot better at it than I can, but I just wanted to show this game off. Um, I'm doing a lot of videos at the moment. I don't know what's so I'm going to just keep playing as I'm talking. Um, hopefully I'll get better. Look, I've got the high score, though. It's not really hard, considering I'm the first person to play it. Um, not the first person. First person to play this one that has been loaded up. Um, yeah, I'd love to know your memories of this game. Um... Where you played it, where, you know, did you save up your pocket money to get it? Did you, uh, did you play at a mate's house around school or stuff like that? I can imagine you're playing this at school. Can you imagine? It, oh, is it educational? Yes. It's learning me how to avoid ducks or whatever the hell they are. I don't know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I oh, just started playing again. So, yeah, Chucky Egg. What an absolute classic. Even if you suck at it. <laughs> it's still a classic. The sounds are great. The, um... Oh, what are you doing there? Up. Oh. There we are. I can clear this one. Of course I can clear this one. It's the first level. <laughs> so, you ready for the, um, the music again? Oh, no. That's not that music. I wanted to die. So we just die and play that music again? And that'll be the end credits and we'll roll it out. Ready? Thanks again for watching. I'll catch you again next time. Bye.